Heard you missed us. We're back. Now, more of the Smod Ghost Morning Show on Sir. All right, man. This is a fucking ad I can I can get behind in a big, bad way. Get behind it like a fucking dude in prison. Passion, <laughs> enthusiasm, desperation. That's how you begin a fucking sales pitch. <laughs> Invoking <laughs> like, prison I rape. Know what to say about that. <laughs> uh, give me some music, James. Give me a beat. Listen to this. Minnesota with a frozen Coca Cola. Spin all night out on a frozen lake. This is the backyard rink song. No, no, let me in. Go ahead. I think that is absolutely fair to say, and Megan, you will back me up. This will be on Kevin's playlist. Yes, I think it's a fun song. I'll listen to this. We will be singing this on the bus nonstop over and over. It's Backyard Rink, man, and that's R I N C, uh, not K C, because they're captains of building fucking rinks in your backyard. That's literally what they do. Hockey is back, ladies and gentlemen. The NHL season starts uh, tonight, I believe. Or did it start? I'm not sure. I, I got to. In fact, when we get done with the uh, the show, I know it's your birthday and all. Center ice <laughs> package for my office, not for the big TV. Okay. It'll work in That'll my work office. That'll work in your office. Yeah, yeah, that's fine because she don't fucking let me. It watch. won't work on the big TV. Yeah, yeah. well, it will, but whatever. Uh, but I, I won't watch it there as much as I'll watch it in, in my office. Anyway, uh, NHL season starts tonight. Hit somebody's on the way. That's what I'm going to do. Hit somebody begins uh, as we know from the song by Warren Zevon Mitch. I'm, uh, with a nine-year-old, a buddy McCracken out on his backyard rink, dreaming he was Rocket Richard. Well, backyard rink and yours truly, that'd be me, Kevin Smith, want to give you guys the chance to live your dreams this season with, get this, motherfuckers, back, <laughs> back up. A free backyard hockey rink giveaway contest. What? I, I'm telling you, listening to Sir, you could literally win a fucking hockey rink in your backyard. Backyard rink is a rink builder. You're going to throw your hat in. I'm going to fucking try to win. We don't have much of a backyard, but it's going to be a thin, skinny rink for a very large man. TV show. TV show. Yeah, exactly. Uh, rink, uh, backyard rink is a rink builder and distributor of nice uh, rink ice rinks, the world's number one backyard ice rinks. They ship hockey rinks custom designed to fit your backyard all over the U.S. and Canada and the world. You can put it over the pool. What? Thank you, <laughs> Megan. Plexiglass. Exactly. Really? Backyard backyard rink owner Greg uh, Mach- Mikowski. Mikowski. I don't know if that's a silent H. Mikowski. Greg. Good old Greg, man. Hockey Greg. He started playing street hockey after seeing Clerks. This picture nobody remembers from years ago. He wrote himself the backyard rink song, which you just heard us uh, listen to. You can hear it in the background. Um, it, it's uh, it's backyard rink, man. This dude literally builds rinks in your backyard. Awesome. Like you've seen, if you go online, you can see pictures of people's fucking ranks. If you go right to their website, of course, which I'm sure I can hit you with. We've got on. It I know on Twitter. Backyardrink.com. But with a C. Yes, with a C. Leave that K off. Replace it with a C, because these motherfuckers are the fucking kings with a C. Uh, leave this K off. Backyard so that's confusing. Rink with the C, with a C that is the captain of Backyard Ice Rinks. They wear the C right on their chest, right mm-hmm. in the name of their. And you can follow them on Twitter at Backyard Rink with a C. Uh, R-I-N-C. This is a really, really cool thing. Oh, my God. Yeah. I'm in love with this. Backyard Rank wants to give every family and all the little Buddy McCrackens mm. in the world a chance to live their dreams. Backyard hockey games, uh, skating parties, 
winter barbecues, bonfires with family and friends will make this season magical in your own backyard winter wonderland. Could you imagine having a fucking skating rink in your backyard and everybody comes over? You're popular. It's like that episode of The Simpsons where they got a pool. <laughs> it's just like that. Uh, to enter for a chance to win a free 20 by 40 backyard hockey rink. Well, the, well, the one mark is feet, right? Two marks is one quote is feet and two quotes uh, two quote marks is sure inches we, right finer details can be found on their website that spinal tap is a big you know they build stonehenge and they put the wrong thing next to it i want to make sure it's not like it's a 20 inch fucking hockey <laughs> <rink."> <laughs> i think that's we this just, is the just stand on it <laughs> 20 feet by 40 feet like think about yeah. it that is the size of jaws almost a full jaws <laughs> width and then almost two jaws is long or 40 feet long. You can skate on that. Fuck yes, you can skate on it, my friend. I was going to say bitch, but <laughs> Megan's not here. Uh, <laughs> right here. <laughs> visit uh, www.backyardrink.com, man. That's backyardrinkrinc.com. Rink is spelled with a C because Backyard Rink is the captain of Backyard Ice Rinks, man. You listen, this is like the Gretzky of fucking rink builders in your backyard. While you're at backyardrink.com, be sure to request a free quote for your family's backyard rink this season or give them a call. Pick up the phone right now. Somebody call these fools right now. Let's and call them. Seven, <laughs> well, not us. We're in direct contact with them. 708-529-3043. While you're there at the website, you can check out the Backyard Rink song uh, video, which is an awesome tune set to a very cool slideshow of amazing ice rinks from all over the world. Are you an ice rink fetishist like myself? I, I'm afraid you're going to start to cry because you love this I so might. much. I might. Oh, there's. I saw a picture of this one dude did in Edmonton did his backyard look like fucking Rexall ice, the like Oilers ice. It was fucking astounding. Um, I wish I could. I wish I, if I had a backyard rink, I would skate all the time, even at age 41. Even though I would bust my hip and shatter my spine, <laughs> I'd pad out big time. You can customize this shit, too. I'd be like, boys, mattresses on all the boards. <laughs> They're like, you don't understand hockey at all, do you? I'm like, no, not really. Uh, the free hockey rink contest winner is going to be announced on Halloween morning on the Smodcast.com uh, Smod Coast Morning Show. So right here on Hall Halloween morning, we'll tell you who's winning a 20 by 40 fucking rink in their backyard. A contest. It's free. Free. Just think about it. You can sit there going like, I've never ice skated in my life. But it's, it's a, free. It's free. It's a fucking contest. You enter, fucking boom. You could walk away with a goddamn hockey rink. That would, you get laid off a hockey rink. Man <laughs> or woman. If you're like, oh, would you like to come over and skate in my private hockey rink? Somebody will fuck you for that. She'll rock a fella. No, you know what yeah. I'm saying? Oh, he'll rock a fella. <laughs> <laughs> or whoever. Um, it's hockey night in Canada, man. Not all across America. Live your dreams. Iggy Biggie, live your dreams. Out of uh, live them out on your backyard rink, man. Visit backyardrink.com today, or don't forget to uh, see him on Twitter. Backyard rink, all one word. B a c k y a r d r i n c. I'm sure the boys have it up in the sin bin. All the all the links, man. But jump in the get in on this fucking contest. You're stupid if you don't. Even if you're like I hate hockey and everything it stands for, you then get the rink, and when they build it. Smash it in front of him. <laughs> It'll break his heart, <laughs> but you'll make a statement. You... I don't know what to say. Like, how do you not enter this contest? Say, even if you don't, you know, you're not into hockey. They come, you you win the contest. You'll be into they hockey. build a rink. Yeah, and then you learn how to play. Or you or not break the fucking rink in front of them and make the fellow cry. Fine. Or <laughs> you could do this. They build the rink. You're like, thanks. I'll love it forever. And they leave, and you start renting out ice time yeah. to yeah. locals, and you earn off of something that you were the. You're just sitting around listening to a fucking podcast, and you're like, oh, for shits and giggles, I'll try to win a fucking skating rink. And you win it. Come on. I'm entering. Iggy Biggy. Fantasy <laughs> good times come to life here on the Spot Coast Morning Show. You can fit it in here if you move some couches around. You are not kidding, Ryan. All right. Thank Ryan, you. Thank the Quinlins are turning against when you. When you have I'm talked my wife into bed with your smooth, I smooth have oh, man. As, the, as it all concludes, the pillow talk should be nothing but ice rink in the living room. They're like, you know how we make it up to your husband? Ice rink. Tanya Harding. <laughs> Nobody has to get hurt. Um, it's just hockey. Nobody has to get hurt. <laughs> there it is, man. Backyard rank. This has to be the coolest sponsor to me of all fucking time. And again, I'm going to look into, you know, sweepstakes rules and see if I can actually win this shit. 
because fuck all y'all. Who don't want <laughs> a free fucking hockey rink in their back? Ah! Or one, if you don't win the contest, that, you know, I'm sure is reasonably priced. Yeah, that's the thing. If you don't win, you can get one for yourself. Still get one. Yeah, man. I mean, this is, it's a business. This is a, I, I crazy love that this is a business. That some dude's like, you know what I do for a living? Could you imagine you're sitting yeah. in a fucking bar and you know, you're watching a fucking game. You're like, Oh, gophers or whatever. <laughs> and, um, and then, uh, you is know, he's like, me? right. That's for you. <laughs> and then he's like, uh, all oh, right. And you get chit chat. He's like, what do you do? He's like, me. I build backyard hockey rinks for a living. That's living to- the dream. That is li- you would go home with that dude. Oh my like, god! Jen, I gotta go. <laughs> go home with him. And my hand would be in his lap at the bar, and he'd be like, "This is awkward." And I'm like, "I just right, really so respect in you." In the bathroom at the bar? <laughs> yeah, probably not in the bathroom. Right it's there, state. in front like, of people. I can't wait to get home. I'm turning around in my stool, going, "Look at me, jerk this fella off." You know what he does for a living? <laughs> respect this man. They're like, "Him, we do. You, not so much." <laughs> Sir, we're gonna have to ask you to leave. <laughs> I'm like, "Why?" <laughs> oh, it happens every time. Time to skate. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, we gotta have Ryan around his punch up, dude. <laughs> um, there it is, right now. Go to Twitter and follow Backyard Rink with a C, not a K, or go to their website, backyardrink.com today, and enter the fucking. We're in the future, bitch. You know how Jetsons this is? This is so Jetsons. Could you go talk to fucking a young uh, Wayne Gretzky, and he'll tell you about how his dad flooded the backyard, and that's where he uh, practiced, and he became. Sure. The greatest hockey player of all the time. Great one, best 99. athlete ever. Best athlete. Great. He dominates the, his best stats. Athlete. Don't even get me started. But what I'm saying Please, is. I am begging you, Ryan. Don't 10, get him started. hours of practice, Malcolm Gladwell tells us, will make you great at anything. You can start practicing right now. And you're, maybe not you. If you're like 40, you're, you're done. But you can Why have a rink happen? and enjoy it. But your kid could literally make something of themselves in the backyard. I still rink. have 10,000 hours left, don't I? Yeah, but. I don't know. Would you, you really? I mean, really enough to like? I guess you're right. You do have yeah. ten thousand hours. Uh, thanks. But the question is, somebody's rumbling. Somebody's boop buzzing. Uh, so the question would be, what do you do? What do you practice for ten thousand hours? Ice skating? Like, if we get a rink if in the backyard. If we get a rink in the backyard, hell yeah! I'll don't go. even fucking tell me, I, I, bitch. A, I will fucking buy a house and put a rink in. If you were to like, buy a backyard, we can totally put a rink in it, and we will Every hire a backyard will rink. Because then you and I can play my favorite movie of all time, and you can be like, toe pick. What, Two no? pick the fucking cutting edge. I could be DB Sweeney. No, you could be fucking Moira Kelly and shit. Because I used to. We have could do a the life. Pachenko. <laughs> I could lift you over my head and shit. Come on, be amazed. We'll fall in love. Remember, win you, some gold. You carried me to the um, library the other day. I was cute. I did. You know, See, it's just like the Pachenko. <laughs> I carried you on my back. Backyard <laughs> rink. These motherfuckers. It, I, I'm telling you, I'm buying a rink. They don't even have to give me one. I'm figuring out where to put it, and Dude, I'm buying a rink you because give this me a backyard is genius. The rink is there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna level the rooftop. Okay. Right up top. It's I said, flat, dude. Quinlan's the roof is flat play. up top. Fucking Hunt. Quinlan's. I said, get me a backyard Aren't you and interested? I can have a rink. Think about what goes <laughs> into this. Not my living this. room, not my swimming pool, not my roof. <laughs> it must involve refrigeration of some sort, right? Keeping yeah. the ice cold, even yeah, though it's outside. So, I mean, this is a complex. When they're saying, like, hey, man, you could win a 20 by 40 rink, that's fucking... You know what I'm saying? Like, that's a big deal. You gotta be like the piping on the heat of floors yeah. underneath, yeah. except, yeah. except nice. for cold. Oh my God. I, uh, I, backyard I, rink, man. Having, I, as you can tell, I'm fucking charmed by this beyond belief. Having grown up in South Florida, yes. where it's, you know, it's hot. <laughs> I stink at ice skating. Right. Have you ever seen Great me? Great way skate? to learn. Yes. No, Wait, I don't think Ryan, I you're going to get smacked. I've never seen I don't you. Think you I, no, you saw, I've seen you I on roller skates. I know to throw things from the table. There are lots of little items. I'm used that, to projectiles. <laughs> I've had heels. And I saw you on roller skates. Yeah, I, well, I went roller skating every weekend when I was young. You know, early so 80s. Stop fucking bragging because you're never going to be as cool as BackyardRank.com. <laughs> Fair enough. But I here's, here's my thing to you. It's sad that your fucking life was wasted not ice skating. But... These I just said, get me a backyard. We everywhere. Get a I learned how to ice skate. In the U.S. So in Florida, you could have your own backyard rink. Like, could you imagine, like, living in Florida where it gets to be fucking 80 degrees during the summer, uh, winter, <laughs> winter. <laughs> Thank you. Um, and still, you rock in a fucking uh, ice rink in your backyard. Everyone's over at your house. You are. They're writing articles about you 
in the local paper. Yeah. Local news teams coming over. Hands yeah, yeah, down, yeah. the like local idiot wins contest. Maybe helicopter shots. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes. Yeah. I'm telling you, this is okay, this, this is balloon the... just scared the crap out of me. I'm like, oh my god, my mother's coming over here to spank me for some reason. <laughs> She's like, shut your <laughs> mouth. <Something> li- <laughs> <laughs> um, you could have the little uh, what, what 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 Kevin? What is that? Uh, Little kid team that mites. Yeah, you could have a mites contest in your backyard, watching little kids flop around All in hockey of the outfits. Neighborhood kids coming over, and, and you can you play know. the peanuts music while they do it. <laughs> does the thirty minute? Does the thirty minute uh, well press for them constitute free swag, as in an ice rink on your roof? I know, right? dude. Uh, all right, uh, I'll take it. <laughs> it comes a rejecta. Uh, uh, Number one. There you go. Uh, one. <laughs> backyard, <laughs> backyard <laughs> rink. Why, why the fuck you aren't there right now at backyardrink.com or calling up good old Greg at seven zero eight five two nine three zero four three is fucking beyond me. Stop insulting me. <laughs> Stop looking at me and yelling at me. Call I'm these. Like, People. All right, I am. You know what I happens? just said that we should call them. You are somebody, looking at me. You're yelling somebody at me. Has like an I've idea. offended you. This brilliant. This is like the leftorium. Okay. <laughs> You Ned just got to let people know. Absolutely. <laughs> you got to let people know that it exists. If the people knew that it existed, man, they'd be like a backyard fucking rink, a rink in my backyard. I could be Rocket Richard, and they'd <laughs> rhyme like that for hours. I could be Albertine. Nah, all right. Nobody knows that. Yet. Um, all right, man. So there it is. Go to backyardrink, uh, dot com. Give me a bumper and then we go back into it. We're just fucking. You're listening there you go. to Sir <laughs> Smodcast Internet Radio. All right, man. Now we're back. Not like we didn't go anywhere. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's a bumper. <laughs> yeah, that's enough. It's enough to get me back into the show. Uh, welcome back, everybody, to the Smod Coast Morning Show. I'm Kevin Smith. Jen Schwabach. And we're celebrating the birthday of Megan Quinlan. Oh. Say happy, say hi, Megan. Hi, everyone. And her brother's here. Say hi, Ryan. Hey. And as always, uh, James Franco, Jam Master James. I am here. In the background, there's Alan. (laughs) I don't know. (laughs) Alan ran from the table and is not coming back. (laughs) He's, uh, he's he's done the wise thing and stepped away before he gets in trouble misanswering a fucking quiz. (laughs) Um, there it is, man. What do you want to talk about now? Ice rink kit. Um, can you turn on the big screen, please, so no. we can see what you're looking at? No, fucker. Why don't you turn on the big screen so I can see what you're looking at? <laughs> Pay no attention to the man behind the curtain. Yeah, really. Oh, you don't get to my... see my shit. I'm not looking at anything, man. And also, we're, we're like, on a radio show. Breaks. Yeah, because, but <laughs> anyway. You're muttering. Don't stall the show to be like, what are you doing that people can't see? Show me. Let's just keep talking, oh. ever talking. I'm not looking at your fucking finger. <laughs> Uh, Mav Wizard said, "Nice pull on the cutting edge. Damn right, fucking, it's a nice pull." You think you're so cool? <laughs> it's an amazing, fucking pull. Amazing. Cool as a backyard ice skating rink. Oh yes, bitch. Brought to you by <laughs> backyard rink. Come on, that's a good fucking idea, man. That's dope. 